Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, you have to check this brand new Twitter client. It's, it's called Metro Tweet, uh, which uses, uh, which they say is, it's got grade seven integration, taskbar integration, and also autocomplete for username and hashtags, quick glance notifications, flawless high DPI support with vector based user interface, and resizable and reorderable columns like TweetDeck. So I think this is just a TweetDeck uh, ripoff, except it's a worst version, like a bad version of it. Why? Because it uses a lot of RAM. If you see the resources over here, yeah, it's using around 250 MB, which is huge, even for a Twitter client. And because this is a technical beta, we will give it some time. And it's a brand new uh, Twitter client. Here you get some update, like a notification window for the tweets. And you can choose... You can choose um, what you want in the notification. It, it it says toast. Yeah. So if you want just direct message or replies, you can choose that and skip all the other um, options over here. And for Windows 7 taskbar integration, you can even have the like right now over here 47. I don't know what it means. It means probably uh, I've got 47 tweets by maybe friends or replies, search results, and all that. So you can choose the one you want, and the notification sound. Again, you can choose uh, sound for maybe replies or profiles or direct messages and skip for the other uh, options. So that's about alerts and sounds about the services. You can change the interval, uh, skip it to the default. That's the best thing. You can remember this Twitter account, automatically sign in. Okay, so you don't have multiple uh, sign in options, so you cannot add more than one account. So this is permanent, like software update because of technical beta, I think. You cannot start up. I don't know why I cannot select this. And this uh, looks good, you know. Uh, as you saw, there was some white uh, gr graphic animation over there. Again, tweet, uh, minimized metro tweet. Minimized metro tweet. I don't know. Okay, they are going to you know add more options, I think. Uh, okay, now about the main main UI. So here you have got a column which is expandable, or resizable. You can reset it, reset the column width. Here you get the updates or the new Twitter new tweets that's out there. And and okay this is the reply so you can reply back. You can check the oh, like this is my profile right? I think maybe you can check profile by clicking on the username not sure double clicking on it no and then maybe this clicking on this yeah you get clicking on uh, the username you will get the profile and you can even search the profile you want by clicking clicking on user profile and entering the username so and this would be uh, searching the Twitter as you see I got a sound and um, some good cousin of mine just she just sent me a tweet. Okay, so this is where you search on Twitter. This is really slow and sluggish. This technical beta. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it is using a lot of CPU too because it is using a lot of RAM. I'm not sure about the CPU. Mm, what else? I think that's it. If you click on this, it will. It will give you an option to sign out and forget the account. And if you click on the tweets, it will launch the Twitter on your default web browser. And if you click on this username, yeah, it will launch your profile. I guess that's it. Most probably, this is how you uh, reply, retweet, and direct message the user, any user. But I think. Uh, this retweet option should have been there even in replies. That would have been good. I think that feature is there in TweetDeck. So uh, here, the add the column options, add column, search Twitter, whatever you want. Refresh your timeline, and this is for typing anything you want and updating the status, not status, but updating your timeline. So maximize it will stretch 
it will maximize the whole application and resize the column mm, not that I think they have to improve the UI and they have to make it really fast because it's right of it is slow it's not buggy but it is slow okay I'm done with this video so long ago.